love a I love a cliff boss like an edge what? boss. What? Wait, no. What? What? Okay. okay. What? I thought we were gonna echo with a dead castle. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Ignore me. <laughs> You just go. What would the echo of pandemonium? Yeah, it, it, it was a fresh soul. Like just, I just did. Yeah, we're good. Me. Oh, we're good now. It's fine. <laughs> just go to an echo. And just, okay. Kill me. Pandemonium's final gate has been cast wide. I shall await your arrival beyond. It's like one of those Super Bowl dip dispensers. Oh my God! You are ruining this for yeah, me. Yeah, chips in the center, and then the seven kind of dips around the side. Yeah. Fortunately, with the information shared with us by your friends, we've made some strides towards figuring out how to stop her. A crystal called the Heart of Sabak may be the key. Ooh. The researchers quick, uh, related a quick but thorough history of the events leading to the present. Tales that under other circumstances would have been considered childish fantasy, if not for a name that rang true to La Habrea's memories. La Habrea. <laughs> oh, here we go. Yes. The heart of Sabic. To you, the secret of the Ultima weapons might. Not the least, to not least the spell known as Ultima and a source of enduring mystery. We are told that a general from the Galean Empire was gifted this Aurasite by an Asian. The identity of this shadowy benefactor, however, remains a curious unknown. Very curious indeed. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. I wonder why. Is there all you are withholding? Very well. At present, the heart of Sabek itself is of greater moment. She brought before us a crystal she claimed to have chanced upon, saying it contained immense power. She dubbed it Arasite, studying it with a fervor unusual even for her. The eventual fruit of her efforts was a Stygian crystal unlike aught we had ever seen, the Heart of Sabak. I would like to know all of this. Well, we can find out two. So let's find out two things. I think how she found it is going to be answered by just three and one are yeah three yeah. probably so you you do one because it's most important I'll take three and together we'll get most of the answers and they're probably oh wait shit be. three is only there because we did a release god damn I oh sweet awesome yeah. oh Evilise oh man I remember so little of Evilise. <sighs> Right, I'm that, going three. Just remember that damn play. I, oh, you're. I was gonna go three. Oh, you can go. Th I'll go. Okay, three. you put that information on screen. I'll do all what right. is Orisa. Right, I'm not even sure if this changes at all. Oh well, mine does not show an image. Mine says we theorize that it came from beyond our star. Beyond that, naught was ever known. Much later. Much later, we discovered that Orisa manifests the desires of those who come in contact with it. This would do much to explain Athena's actions following her recovery of the crystal. An unexpectedly specific question. I gather that the heart of Savak is not the only Aura site in this era. Regardless, I know not of this High Seraph. Athena was never forthcoming as to how she found the crystal. Though we came to suspect that it was not of our star. Well, there you are. We're kind of getting a cornucopia of all the answers here. So what became of the heart of Savak? I took it from Athena's laboratory after I ended her life. The density of the ether within was unlike anything I had observed. I knew its capacity for destruction, but further analysis proved impossible. I elected to safeguard it myself. If she included some mechanism by which to give these memories form, as she did with our own, she would be reborn. Ironic that I should have protected those very memories in the name of safeguarding the star. So she hit herself. So he was so cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. Apparently he took like the rarest, most powerful thing that he happened to have as an inventory and was like, hey, Gaius, hey, level 50, Gaius, shove it in the engine. Continuing the long tradition ah. of shoving very important things in engines. 
yes. in Final Fantasy fourteen. Yes. So right. he like legitimately is crazy. Like we thought he was crazy. That was not a question. But now he's like so freaking crazy. He just like we that was, gave it to G- Gaius for no reason. We we never. That was never in question. That like the whole point of this, the whole point, especially of uh, the second wing of Pandemonium, was like playing up the humor of us being like, "That this is La Habrea." Seems pretty well adjusted. Like, like yeah, La Habrea being crazy in Rama Born was not in question. That was confirmed. Do a dance. And Ooh, whatever this is, it looks pretty. Is that the? How many seats are there? It looks like a council room. Is that? That'd be sick. Is that like where the convocation? I'm down is? for it. What is going on here? We'll find out soon. There are 14 se- I count 14 seats. When was this crystal lost sighted? <laughs> <clears throat> During my fight with the ultimate weapon! It's nerdy, but yes, I mean. In which you triumphed, but failed to recover the heart. Yet according to your colleagues, there was another on the battlefield that day. An Asian. And this self-same Asian was later struck down at a location known as the Etherochemical Research Facility. And it was Heaven's Ward, and it was awesome. I have heard that name recently, the site of Professor Claudian's disappearance. Indeed. But what reason would he have to bring her back to life? Was his mind not his own? Yet more questions without answers. If Elidibus is to be believed... She readies this vessel for Godwin and is perilously close to success. I'm sorry, I'm having trouble maintaining this voice. <laughs> <clears throat> what if it's freaking Gigapope's body she found? Because Gigapope was now your face of God. <laughs> it's just like that everything. would be awesome. It's just like everything all at once. That would be, uh, I mean, I mean, she wants him to be a God. Back to Labra here. It beggars belief. As you well know, you were the linchpin of her ambition. Yours was the only form that could contain the immense power Athena required, and it has long since turned to dust. (laughs) As pleasant as this discussion is, we require more information if we're to unravel this mystery. So does the music stop every time he goes into NPC mode? I was programmed to be like this. You know who awaits you, Val. Antuna. I am excited for whatever the hell this is. Yeah, yeah. People were saying it's 11, right? We're saying they were thinking 11 would be my favorite. I'm curious as to why. Hey, everyone, and welcome to our Clips and Highlights channel. If you want to keep up with everything Kyle and I have going on, make sure you subscribe to the main Grinding Gear YouTube channel, which is where we actually do these streams. That's right. We stream right here on YouTube. Oh, and uh, sub to the Grinding Gear podcast. Apple, Google, Spotify, really any podcast platform. We're probably there. Thanks. Hey, let's see your room, bro. Everyone's really excited about the music. Dude, this looks sick. I suppose I have Athena to thank for this incarnation. I have long considered how I might stand against you, I admit. Dude! In transformation, I present to you my truth. I am in living. Oh, we get to see his form! Sick. Oh, shit, yeah. I should have, I feel like I should have seen that coming. Dude, the music. Holy shit. That was nice. I love Shadowbringers so much. (laughs) Oh my god. Ephemeral justice? Shit. Uh. (sighs) That's a good arrangement. This is all right. Mm Mm-hmm. Dude, there's a choir in the background. Okay, y'all. I think I might actually have my music not on 100. Yeah, look at that. We can do better than that. Those are rookie numbers. Yeah. 
There it is. Dude, the choir is such a nice freaking little flourish in the background there. Huh. Honestly, like legit, y'all, I'm going to um I'm I'm going to say I'm thankful that we had the desync issue earlier because I wouldn't be wearing headphones otherwise. <laughs> uh yeah, Solomir, you heard I like the Amarat theme? <laughs> yeah, I, I you know, it's it's a little known fact about me. It's a little known fact. All right, Kyle, I keep it really close to the vest. My love of, of this motif. Yeah, no, nah, it's just something he doesn't really talk about yeah. too much. Uh, check the. Oh, oh we're, we're just in pandemonium. But, but how do I check the place's name? Like just the map. The chamber of the fourteen. Oh shit. Yeah, the door appears to be a match to the flaming Amarot door. <gasps> Dude. From what? I'm seeing. I mean, oh, granted, so this is where we only shot from the lower Wait, part. Wait, is this where we like fought Birdman? Wasn't that a circle room, or am I overthinking? Birdman? Oh, you. Oh, that's an no. Interesting there were no chairs. Thought. There were no chairs. Oh yeah, outside the window. Oh shit. Oh yeah, dude. Amarat is just outside. It is just Amarat outside. I'm gonna. I'm trying not to step here and die and I don't want to pull the boss um, we can do this after we you know you know this is, this is a fix for this Kyle after we beat a little bit I can get closer to the windows it is not a match for the uh, the birdman room floor which would be fascinating oh hey there's that bogus statue that was up on the ceiling Wait, what? the rooftop so at the end of uh, Katesis the, the bird statue no the one where like the, the ancient died to summon a weird bird that wasn't Katesis. That was one of the Aniders. Aniders. Um, one of the one of the Aniders. Where, where? Right over there. Uh, between chair two and three. Oh shit. Okay. The academia. Okay. The academia. Yeah. Kyle vindicated. And then we've got on the wall there what looks like a combination of all their masks, kind of in motif together someone coordinated the window to Amarat and to triangulate which building holds a convocation oh shit because the door looks like Emmett's door what you know yeah yeah definitely but yeah uh, I'd love a link to that in uh, discord yes Aaron yes that piano though appreciate the super um well Kyle well well hang on I need I have a couple people I need to res um, no, no, that's not what I was getting at. If you want to hit me with a yes, Garrett. Oh, yes, Garrett. I'm declaring this my favorite raid in all of Final Fantasy IV. There, okay, go for I'm, it. I am officially declaring it. I know we have one boss left. I'm done. I'm spent. This was worth the price of admission. I don't care what happens after this. This is my favorite raid in the game. Yeah, I'm declaring it. Done and oh, done. Interesting. They all have different objects in the background. They're mirrored on each side. Let's kill the boss and then I can look around freely. Uh, if, if, if Camper is sending me with this, this message that says outside the windows, you can see the spires of Emerald fairly gleaming. Do you know why, Kyle? Why? Before the rains have ceased and we have all been graced with another beautiful day. I mean, this has some big... Because it's an Elidibus quote, Kyle. This has some big Jedi Council bullshit going on. Like, oh, totally. But I love Jedi Council bullshit. You were in the wrong. Look at your room. Yeah, whose sigil is that over and over and over and over again? Is that La Habrea's? Which the, one? The, look at the, like, it kind of looks like a tapestry. Oh, no, that's what I'm saying is a combination of all their sigils. Oh, it's like a combo? Yeah, because that's way too many... So Is you it could, just La Habrea's? You could probably get them all going. That looks too busy. That looks way too busy. I can't make out Hades. I'm looking for like the little Hades face. Oh, I guess the hash marks are also from Hades. Oh man, I want to do a breakdown of that. I want to pull up all of their sigils. all 14s. So where is uh, where is Azum? What's going on here? God 
Jeez, this track rips. Okay, all right, let's actually do the fight. Kill him. Let's do the fight. Everybody ready? How we feeling? Right, y'all, y'all can, uh, y'all can debate how many sigils are there. We're not gonna get three guide. We're gonna. Uh, no, we're only gonna get, get fourteen guide. We're gonna eight died. That's what we're gonna do. Wah! My heart quivers in anticipation. It is a. You know we have to watch that this Halloween because I've never seen it, right, Kyle? Yeah, I'm down for that. Will light and break so Woo! Right? Dude, that pose is cool. Do you see the hair? Can we melt down? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh. Excuse me, ripples of gloom. That is a handsome one, too. Divisive ruling. Oh, no! Oh, no! I got got! How did I get over here? They're they're at least consistent. You know me. Great wide damage. That didn't seem that bad. It's a bleeding thing. That's why it's oh, not too bad. it's a persist thing. Balance needs to be maintained. Do we need to divide like four and four? Yeah, four and four, right? I'm gonna just assume. Ah, I'm going to the other side. What's going on here? Though with ethereal polarity is tilted oh, towards the light, you? the balance of darkness remains intact. Wait, what? Wait, what the frick is here? You be judged worthy to exist. Safety center. Oh, and we get knocked at, knocked back again, huh? Ooh. Oh, 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 that's tricky. It's tricky, 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 tricky. Normally I'd say do the opposite, but sigil tilt. To oh, oh, that's, your that says dangerously, so I'm gonna go over here. Light and oh, okay. <laughs> is that was that just because of how many people were there, or is it because I did the Will other color? That's what I'm not sure. These spell effects. Gonna, I'm just gonna see what happens. Like, what a stack marker. Why is there a tether? Yeah, I don't know what the tether's about. Oh, jeez. Oh, gross. Oh, I think I made it out in time. Oh, that was close. Oh, that just keeps going. I am the emissary. Dark and light. Shall never die. What happens if I get if I just stand on this? Nothing? I think you gotta wait for you to choose you. To give you give you some symbols on you. Oh, okay. I was just moving too fast. Oh, now I see what was happening. Oh, what? Oh, down the middle. I think this is the one that gets wider. Ah. Yep. yep. It was in fact the one that gets wider. These magics are not for you to Worthy to exist. 
Oh, I should probably get back in this. Oops. <laughs> I got excited. <laughs> that was great. I hope, I hope, I hope there's some lols in chat. I want to see some lols. It. it was beautiful. Glad you had a good time, buddy. <laughs> I, uh, I did it on purpose. Uh, Kyle hadn't laughed in a while. Um, I just wanted to make sure my good buddy. This one make me look like I was really good at rezzing. I appreciate yeah. that. Yeah, you know, it, 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 Kyle hadn't hadn't shown off in a while. So uh, I just wanted to give my good buddy something to talk about. So get in for a little missionary action. Oh, oh. This this is a fun dance. The in and out. In and out's always fun. Good burgers. Good dances. Oh, he made copy. Woo! But they're like aspected copies. Are they? Oh, they're, they're purple and it. Well, it's the dark and light thing going on. What was. Jeez. These magics are not for you to win. Don't go in too soon. Oh. From beyond! I'm not paying attention to. I like his pole arm. The texture work in the wings are quite nice. Thing to say. Now to take your measure. Purple, so that'll be middle. Right. Yes. Figured it out, Kyle. I nice looked job. at the boss and divined a mechanic. Well done. And I'm gonna keep my ass in this circle, so Please help me God. That pops my dark yeah. Oh, oh no! Oh, oh. I almost did it again. Shot me with lasers. Gentle lasers. He killed me, Kyle. He killed me with laser. <laughs> I thought that was you talking to me. That fight yeah. was damn delightful. Uh, team, we gotta have a talk about our glams. <laughs> I think we're fabulous. You would. That's so rad. Let me just look at them while we're on. Yeah, the Helix building, I guess, would be a pretty big tell. I'm trying to find out where exactly this room is. It's rules. I am, I'm giddy. I'm having a good time tonight, Kyle. 
You know, as opposed to all those other times on the no, stream yeah, when I have a terrible time. Those, the horrible times. Yeah. But, uh, but, yeah, it might be a little, you know, just a... Th this might be a hair above above Golbez for me in terms of my my shit. Personal investment. Yeah, in terms of my personal shit. That that fight was, like, my, my comfort zone of things that I tend to put together quickly. Yeah, it, it, well, like, we yeah. were even right for the wrong reasons about the scale thing when he was like, we'll be judged. And we're like, oh, yeah, we just need four in each. And I just happened to be in the right one twice without oh, that realizing sounds, yeah. that I got a that's debuff. That sounds nice. Well, that's, yeah. just, uh, that's just alliance or eight thoughts. Yeah. <laughs> did I did, do my eyes deceive me? Did we get we did a fairly well? Did I see that go by? Did we get complimented on a first time try? Hey, nice. I'm or or did my eyes well. like legitimately deceive me? I can't find it now, Kyle. It may have been my eyes. You know, just something. let it let it flow. If you you know accidentally imagined a compliment, mm. I'm down for it. Yeah. 